Hi ladies, how are you doing? This is Beverly with Beverly Hills Health and Wellness Coaching. So I'm in my kitchen. I wanted to take a couple of minutes and share with you. So if we haven't met before, my name is Beverly. I'm a certified health and wellness coach and I work with women in the area of menopause to help them elegantly transform their body and their lifestyle in my programs that I offer online and individually in group setting and they are holistically based. So we're in the kitchen and I just wanted to share a really great tip and resource with you. So I was out doing some of my shopping and I am one of these people, anything related to health and wellness, I will do a deep dive. And whenever I'm in the section with books on health and wellness, I will grab them. So here is a book on spices. It's called The Spice Diet. I actually haven't gone through it, but I've kind of thumbed through it. I'm like, oh yeah, this I need in my library. So what I love about this book is it's about incorporating spices into your meal planning. And for those who don't really understand, like spices will be helpful to add flavor and give different nuances to your food, but also it has so many medicinal benefits because each herb and each spice does different things that can help you, you know, in your body lose weight, um, eliminate, you know, cravings. It's like a lot of different things, but you got to know which ones to pick and choose from. So one of the things I wanted to share with you, that's my staple always has been is cinnamon. I am in love with my cinnamon. I find two major things about cinnamon. I love it's like, it can bring a little sweetness to something, but you can't use too much without like, overpowering the flavor of something. So for me, if I'm having like, I love grapefruit, for example. So I'll have like some sliced grapefruit and I'll throw some um, flaxseed, I like great uh, grind up my own flaxseed and I'll put a little pinch of um, cinnamon in there and it adds a little sweetness. I don't add like sugar, like in the spaces where I am, I try to eat as naturally as possible without incorporating sugars because sugars really do not serve us in this space of life. If you're trying to be healthy, if you're trying to get your body where your insulin is like stabilized, sugar is the one like out, don't, don't use it. The other thing that I would say about sugar as I just um, I talk about cinnamon is the sugar, how it affects your body is it brings down the blood glucose level in the water, in your body, in your, in your blood. So one of the things that I do is, I don't know if you can tell it, but I actually have a cinnamon stick in my water. So I drink like cinnamon water continuously. I love having a little flavor to my water. So I will take a cinnamon stick, put it in my water, and I like to charge it with the sun. I'll sit it outside in the sun and get it like warm and the rays of the sun, that vitamin D, like all oh, great things for your body. And then I'll sip on it throughout the day. And it's one of those things like you're doing two great things for your body. One, you're hydrating, which is a great thing. Always stay hydrated. And two, you have that um, cinnamon stick inside and it's working to keep the blood sugars down. So that's a big tip. I mean, if you're a person who's struggling with weight or your doctor has you on insulin, there's a great tip for you right there. So stay with me. I am doing a five day detox at the end of this month. It is January 24th through the 28th. So I invite you to join me for that. I, I've been running it for about a year now and it's been really great for the women. They have lost so much weight. They have gained energy and they've developed a new relationship with food, which is really one of the keys because when you understand how to nourish your body, that's a game changer. Um, one of the things that I want to also add is that I am having a webinar on Sunday, which is the 16th of January at 1 p.m. So join me for that, would you? I'm going to put all the information about the detox in the comments, but I invite you to come along and bring a friend. It's just going to be about an hour. Anything about detox, we're going to cover it, and I'm also going to offer a little early bird special. So check it out. Come join me, and I hope to see you there with a friend. All right, see you next time. Bye.